So will you zaki him, purify you? You notice the power of purification. You and I may ask, look, God is everywhere. He's ubiquitous. He's ever present. What is to take me to go and do wudu? I mean, Allah already knows what's in my heart. I mean, why do I have to wipe my hand or my arms and you know, wipe my head? I mean, God, what is this wiping for? You know, I, you already know what's in my heart. It's even deeper than my skin. Why do I need to clean my skin to come to you? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is telling us that my religion as a symbol of the action is when you come to me, you purify. As pure as your heart may be. Look at our blessed Imam. Imam Zainul Abidin When he used to do wudu, people used to see him turn pale and shivering. They say, Yabna Rasulillah, why are you so pale? He says, I am preparing to go and talk to the owner of the universe. Do you know who that is? Should I not be pale? Imagine if you and I are getting ready to go and speak to the most powerful human being in the world, a king or a president or, or let's say a great scholar that you and I admire just to see their faces. We admire them. Would you not be prepared? Would you not wonder what am I going to say? How am I going to dress? How am I going to sit? The Imam says, Allah is so merciful. He's allowed me access to him at all times, but five times he has made it obligatory to speak to him. Should I not prepare? 